Hello and welcome to another edition of LinkedIn brought to you by Ball State Sports Link. I'm Luke Barron. After coming off an impressive win over Central Michigan last week, the Cardinals football team was looking to carry over that success against Western Michigan on homecoming this weekend. The Cardinals had no such luck, however, as they fell to the Broncos 45-16. Ball State found themselves trailing 14-0 one minute into the game after two quick turnovers. The team could not recover and Coach Stan Parrish voiced his displeasure with the performance. Defense did not play well. Defense did not tackle. Defense didn't run to the ball like they had. Um, we all shared in this loss. Offense, defense, kicking. Uh, uh, there, there wasn't any uh, good phase. And if you, there, there aren't going to be any trap doors. There was a bright spot on the day, however. Michael Lewis became the second leading rusher in Ball State history as he surpassed Bernie Parmalee on the all-time list. Lewis has carried the ball for just over 3,500 yards and only trails Marcus Merriweather in school history. The Ball State women's soccer team was also in action at home this weekend as they took on Miami of Ohio on Friday and Bowling Green Sunday. Ball State fell behind 2-0 Friday before Tina Venata was able to score the lone goal for the Cardinals. Ball State gave up another one soon after and lost the game 3-1. Ball State got off to another slow start on Sunday, falling behind 2-0, but the Cardinals rebounded, scoring three straight goals in the second half. Bowling Green was able to tally one more before time expired and the teams tied 3-3. The Cardinals will look to carry the momentum gained Sunday as they travel this weekend. The Ball State men's golf team is wrapping up their final tournament of the fall season Tuesday. The team is in Cincinnati, competing in the Bearcat Invitational. The Cardinals are currently ranked 43rd in the nation by Golf Stat and are the highest ranked MAC team in the nation. Head coach Mike Fleck has been happy with the team's performance this season, especially at the end of tournaments. With um, the momentum that we've got and the confidence that, that some of these guys have, you know, the, the goal is going to be to try to go down and put ourselves in a position, you know, come the final round to be playing for something. Uh, you know, that's kind of been our approach all along over the years is to, you know, try to play well enough to put yourself in a position come that final round, so hopefully we can continue to do that. That's all for this edition of LinkedIn. For more interviews and coverage, visit bsusportslink.com, like us on Facebook, or follow us on Twitter. We'd like to thank the folks at First Merchants Bank for all their support. For everyone here at Ball State Sports Link, I'm Luke Barron, and now you're LinkedIn.